This episode is sponsored by Pouch. Matt <laughs> I told you Matt the cool. And we're gonna see if he's the real deal. We're going to Vegas for Baptist Stag dude. We'll come back, bro. Or really rich. Oh, you know what? I needed a win, man. Completely insane. I was panicking about it. He's the pool guy. The pool is filthy. We missed it quite close. Oh, one of our guys got stopped by security. Pilot holds impact. Pilot holds impact. So Shabang have just turned up to bring the pool cover finally. Oh my god. I can't believe I'm filming this. Yeah! That's where we're staying the encore. You got the win over there. I'll get, I'll get a picture. <laughs> love, 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 yeah. 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 Why? Today is my birthday. This is the man right here. This, this is the man right here. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> That's a wrap. Today, Okay, you guys know I love my trainers and you look always say that at me for battering my trainers. I've got quite a few in here, yeah, they're, they're, a few of them are, are battered. So this guy here is a guy called Jay. Right, his company is the Crip Cleaner. He's told me, Jan, I've seen what you do with your trainers. I know you batter them, but I've got you. So I'm like, okay then, let's try you out. Let's see, people talk a good game and we're gonna see if he's the real deal. Anyway, so I've put quite a few in here. Okay, some of these are really clean. These are my wife's trainers. Like they're just like a little bit dirty. He's like, Jan, don't worry, don't worry, I got this. So I put a few, even my, like look at the state of my loops. That's it. No problem for you is this bread and butter? No problem. Simple, yeah? Easy. Okay, cool. So no pressure. So Jay's gonna take these away and we're gonna see if he really is the Crip Cleaner. Let's get it, Jan. Let's see. Appreciate it. Do you know what I've just realized? He's taken all my trainers. I've got to go to Vegas in a couple of days time. You know what that means? I need to buy some new trainers. Any excuse. You guys know I've got a massive trainer collection and I don't mind spending money on trainers, but I do like a good deal. So when I'm shopping online for anything, I always use Pouch. Pouch is a free desktop browser extension that automatically finds and applies the best discount codes when you're shopping online. I was shopping on Foot Asylum for some new trainers and when I got to the checkout, Pouch automatically popped up. It found me five codes and applied it, saving me 11 pounds on these Jordans. That's not bad. Pouch works on over 3,000 UK sites like Curry's, Adidas, Tesco's, and they've even got EasyJet for holidays. Even if there are no live codes available at the time that you're shopping online, you can still earn points from participating retailers which can be redeemed for gift cards. Pouch only takes a couple of clicks to install and make sure you pin it to your browser. So get Pouch for free right now by clicking the link at the top of this video description. Oh, look at that. They have discounts at Halfords and Sports Direct. I wonder, what could you possibly buy from there? Hmm. We're going to Vegas for Baptist Stag do. We'll come back, bro. Or really rich. Um, see you at 7, 7 a.m. Yeah. Behave. Behave. Oh, come on. Mm. Don't break my range. You know what happens, and it's not with my own new car, I'm never here. They break something, and it's like, it's always on yours. Yeah. It's all right, if we That's break something, cool. you can just pay for it. Wee! <laughs> okay, hey now, it's a new kid on the playground. Yeah. So many bags on me, you would have thought I would just spray ground. Now they know I Early start, just arrived at the airport. We're at Heathrow, heading to Vegas. About to take off, about 11 hour flight to Phoenix, and then from Phoenix, flight to Vegas. And then I've got Bab next to me. So while I'm sitting here enjoying my food, the boys back at Yanomai's will be wrapping my car. So here's a cool story. Me, Babs, and everyone else just sprinting, as you can see, we're all sweating, we're all knackered. We missed it. Flight closed. Can't believe it. Literally, the plane's still there. And like, oh my god, look, you can see it saying closed over there. Look. Oh, one of our guys got stopped by security as well, so now we're gonna see if we can get another flight. So here's an update. We're still at the airport because me and Bav first class seats on the wide well, business class seats on the other flight. They gave a priority on this flight. Whereas the other guys flew out pre McConaughey, me, which means they had no flights for this. So they booked another plane which has just been cancelled then they booked another flight it's just been cancelled now they've booked a private jet to try and take them to vegas and hopefully we'll arrive at the same time and then obviously sort all the luggage out because we don't even know where the luggage is they're moving it from plane to plane and brutal the next plane now waiting to take off but they won't have to take off because it's fun bunching. so we're just stuck on the plane now the way it works in america is when it's thunder or any sort of rain or whatever, they just stop everyone from working. 
first lesson, don't fly American Airlines. Second lesson, don't fly with connecting flight, like, always fly direct. Gotta laugh, gotta laugh. We will get to Vegas eventually. And that's the rest of the guys on that plane there. So they had to get the private jet because they couldn't get a seat on this plane because we flew out originally on this flight would be first class so we managed to keep our flights whereas they couldn't get a ticket so they tried to put um, Southwestern it failed and then they got a private jet in the end which is quite cheap $900 each made it here they come here come the troops one by one yes my friend does look like oj simpson i always call him that and even people out there were like man that looks like oj one by one one by one one by one he bust customs made it uh, this is the bathroom in the minibar oh a little encore snacks Never sleep. It's the final piece of the puzzle. The front bumper is looking very yellow. <laughs> okay, hey now, it's a new kid on the playground. Yeah. So many bags on me, you would have thought I would get spray ground. Wow, it is hot. It's about 45 degrees out here. We had a busy night last night. It was called French Montana. Um, I'm cool because I don't drink. Oh, but these lot, <laughs> they finished. He's finished. That's where we're staying, the Encore. You got the Wynn over there, owned by the same person. Well, they were. It was owned by Steve Wynn. And then he got this for his wife, and then they got divorced. So she now has that one, and he has that one. When you come to Denny's, and it is just straight up heart attack food. So I guess I've got to burn these calories off. Let's head to the pool. Heading back to London. Vegas has been great. Thank you to the, the Win and Encore because they showed us some ad love. I'm excited as well to see what my car looks like. I only come up with smashed it out of the park. Right, so the car is pretty much complete. Jan's on his way. He's just doing the last bit, so just cleaning the car. So we're going to try to smash that out quick time before he comes and hopefully we get the proper reveal done. I made it, I made it, I made it, I made it. So yes, boys. Yes, Gussie. Yeah, then. Cool? Yeah. Welcome back. Thank you, mate. Justin with the first tree. Yes, yeah, so oh, what's going on? What's that tree? Jeez. Yeah, welcome back. Yeah. Is that very cool? Welcome back. Yeah. You good? Your car's done. So, if you want to see the full video reveal click here and let's just say I am a little indecisive. So when I go away, the dog usually goes back to Protection Dogs Worldwide for some extra training. Have a little look at what's been going on. There's gonna be a full video coming real soon, but Uzi has been working hard while I've been on holiday. <laughs> We are not worthy. Extra, extra, read about it. I'm today's trying to tap it. I told you, Matt, Matt's cool. Right, Ray, Gus, uh, Dion, uh, Rio, Dion. Hello, Dion, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, wow. Oh, I don't know. What Proper car guy. Oh. That. Although this, I'd like to, I've never been one of these, so I'd really like to have a go in that. Put off for the whole city. You're more famous than Yanomites, basically. I don't know about that. I had to be there. Just got myself a select. 
No, you are. You are. No, you definitely did. Let's, let's yeah. be straight, yeah? Early days of being famous, I was, you're the guy that done KSI's car. So that's what I used to do yeah, yeah. all the time. Then I was, you're the fellow off the telly. Mm -hmm. Now, you're the car wow guy. Uh -huh. You're the guy with maths. I love you and Matt. Love, that's why I get now. So that is the, the new celeb one that I get. Mm -hmm. You must, you, you can't say you, mate, if I get recognised and it's your show, mm -hmm. you must get recognised all the time. There's a lot of people I know that got put on to Yanomai's through of, car wow. Yeah, through car wow. Listen, his house, yeah, his house. His house is nice. No, it's not. No, okay, okay, <laughs> okay, okay, okay. But, Joe but, says his garden is 10 yan, probably not even that, 20 yanomizes? No, I don't know. It's 30 yanomizes? It's like a park, it's 17 acres. I, I've got this tractor which you have to use to mow it, and things grow really quickly in springtime, I didn't realise. And then the tractor broke, and this, yeah. like, these plants just start growing, and it's like Jumanji. It's <laughs> crazy. It's completely insane. I was panicking about it. Oh, I don't know what I've done really. You're, you're, you're up for this, yeah? You're up for, you're up for some jokes and a laugh, but yeah? What time will you finish with me? Cause I'll... We'll be quick. Okay. We'll be quick, don't worry. Sorry. If I say chew, pause. 45 minutes. <laughs> By half nine, you're out of it? Pause. Okay. Do you know about pause? No. Pause is like a section in your window. Yeah. So if I say, if I say to you, oh, that's really big. Yeah. Pause. Yeah. Because obviously. So I pause. No, no, no. You say pause. Section, you just say pause and it just takes it away. Wow. One of these cars is wrapped in something black. Yeah. The other car that is, is matte PPF. Okay. That's a wrap. No. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> no, nah, this is definitely the wrap. So then that's the PPF. Yeah. Why? No, I think. <laughs> I think it's just like the finish of it. It's like I'm seeing. Through that one, I see through it a little bit. That I don't see through it. Or I could just be making it up if I'm wrong. Okay, you're definitely making it up, but okay. you are right. Okay. The, way, the way to really know though, yeah, okay. is with, with wrap, yeah. you finish yeah, underneath. You, you can't see any edges. With PPF, you've got to yeah, you got the, the edge. edge. Do you know, I was going to think, look at that, but then the finish. Oh, we are good, though. Why, why is it that you can't finish underneath on it? Because of the <laughs> 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 Let's right, see. you ready? Yeah, what are we doing now? Right, let's get it up, Steve. That's, that's my, my first challenge. <laughs> your first challenge? What about your first? Let's be honest, do you recognise anyone? Do you recognise any of these people? Who's that? It's that guy. Oh. I have no idea. Derek Chisora. Who's he? Mm. Okay, who, who's who's that guy? Who's that guy? It's a look. I don't know. Stormzy. Oh, Stormzy. You know who Stormzy is? No. <laughs> <laughs> who's that? Yeah, you know that guy. I've no idea. James Arthur. Who's he? No. Go on then, who are these oh two? My God. They look like they might have been in One Direction. Correct. Because... Okay, what about this fella here? <laughs> uh, the guy with his gut out? Yeah. I don't know. Stavros Blatty. Who's he? Does he own Easy Jet or something? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Easy Jet. Where would you like to sign? Right, you can sign on the ceiling, you can sign on the wall, you can sign here, you can sign wherever you want to sign. Where would you like to sign? Let's just go here. Why not? There. I've got the worst writing ever. Is that your signature? That's my signature. No, it's not. Is that it? You're not going to write like anything else? What? Do, no. I see. Sim. Maybe write Matt Watson slut like. Carwell. Yeah, exactly. Carl, there you go, Gus. Oh, well. There we go. Yeah, give it, give it right, let's, take, let's get the picture. Let's get the picture. Once you go, sound right. really underwhelmed by that. I so. am very. <laughs> let's just stop all that. I'm not going to know this. this. Is. Okay, yeah, oh, I'm not wearing this. Okay. <laughs> Clap the room. I'm coming through. They want to see what I'm about. Yeah, I got skills. Do it for the thrill. I'm on a paper route. Extra, extra, read about it. I'm today's trying to tap it. I put commas over bullshit. Sign the wall. Finally. Time to do what he really came here for, which you'll see on another video, but I can't really reveal it right now. So we're going to sign off from this one. Okay. Um, so say bye to them. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> Literally. I mean... Right, Matt's out of here. <laughs> and we're going to go downstairs and shoot what we have to shoot. Yeah. Matt wants to be car. Well, we do love him, to be fair. <laughs> I've not had anything to eat today, I'm starving. Pause. <laughs> right, let's get downstairs, okay? Right, let's go. Right. So Shebang have just turned up to bring the pool cover finally. It's finally getting sorted out. I know I've been going on about it forever. This is the man right here. This, this is the man right here. I know it's how you got the heavy lifting this end with the big boys and down there, they're just, they're just there looking pretty, isn't they? Look, you always got the young boy in the middle, yeah? Clever. 
400 kilograms. 400 Light work for you, mate. Yeah, bring it forward now, lads. So what they're going to do now is they're going to lay it here until tomorrow when they come back with the extra bits and then they're going to cut it into the floor. So, well done, well done, well done. If you'd have seen me surprise my wife with a new car and we got a great reaction, check out the video right now. But we did run into a little problem when I got back to the house. So we've had the car all of 30 seconds and we've stuck a trailer on the back. <laughs> because that need that's full of ad blue down there so yeah look at this though i've never actually had this problem with ad blue um but here, here's a quick description of what ad blue is even though my new range rover does actually have ad blue anyway i've got faith in the boys let's hope they can do it oh my god oh my god <laughs> i can't believe i'm filming this oh he's done it he's done it keep going keep... oh no will needs to go slightly to the right and then you're good up there for thinking, down there for dancing, mate. I think you might have to go back again, but. <laughs> I'd, I'd, I'd go the wheel touch to the left. Wheel touch to the left. That's it there. It's fine. Oh, he's done it. I can't believe it. I tell you what. We've all, we've all got. No, no, don't, don't take credit for it now. Don't give it to big guns. And people say it would never get used for anything, the Defender. What do they know? So the Defender is not even an hour old. <laughs> and we're using it to tow. But that is what it's for. Oh, he's pretty good, isn't he? To be fair to him. Look at that. Like a glove. Mate, not even one forward or back. Just literally, just straight in, yeah? Your missus must love you. <laughs> so today is my birthday. What's that? Is that Baba's card? Is that Baba's card? Ta? Thank you. Ooh. Thank you. Thank you. Ooh. Let's reopen it. Let's reopen it. Thank you, Fez. Look, look, look at the card. Look at the card. Look at Baba's card. Fez, look. Ah. Today, we're straight to Urban to put the full kit, the wheels, the sidestep. It's gonna have absolutely everything with this car. The kit and everything is out for it. So unlike my Range where we've done the wheels and the calipers and the sidesteps, the kit's not actually out. For this one, they've got everything available. It's gonna be a huge, huge transformation and I'm really excited. So this is gonna stay here for now and I'm gonna head back. So within 24 hours, I fitted the full Urban kit and she got wrapped. Check out the video right now and I'll be honest with you, it's actually better than my car. So the guys are back, cutting the strip, be able to push that over. Finally getting there, we're finally getting there. Astro Carer here as well, sorting out the grass, giving it a good clean. You're back. Look at that, look at that. Look at the boy, look at the boy. He's loving it, he's on camera, he's loving it. Look, he's acting like he ain't, but he's trying to style it. What's that being laid on the grass now? This is the sanitizer, this is the cleaner. Yeah. The third coat that's going in. I'm gonna give that a good flush too. Range Rover said they've got the new Range Rover Sports um, at Grange where I picked up my range. So we're gonna head over there and have a look at that because that is obviously the one that I really like with the SVR version. Ready? Yeah. Andrew's sleeping, so we're just going. Yeah. Teenagers. <laughs> So this is, is the new Range Rover Sport P400 Dynamic SE. So it's fully, fully color coded. It looks very similar to like a Nardo gray. So this is the interior of the new Sport. Very, very similar to the Vogue. Same sort of gear stick, center console, start button in the middle with the big iPad screen. I'm not sure about this. This is a bit, a bit weird, but this is the petrol, three liter petrol. So again, see the new shapes now. The screen, digital dash, the rear mirror, we do that, which is quite cool. 
black interior is nice. Comes with 24 inch wheels as well. And this car would be 93,000 pounds. Sport's always what I've always preferred over the Vogue or the big Range Rover, depending on what you want to call it. The back's very, very different. As you can see, it's very, very flat. The number plate is moving now to the lower part. Got quite a nice rear diffuser with the exhaust either side. But yeah, you're reversing this car. You've got no protection anywhere for a rear bumper. It's all blended in. It's quite interesting. You've got the new shape there and you've got the old shape there. The big difference is the rear. If you look at the rear, this actually has a bumper on it and the number plate is high compared to the one over there. They dropped the number plate really, really low and they just made it very flush across the back. And obviously it's different to the Vogue where the Vogue has the lights running down. This has gone and it's kept it across the back. Very Porsche-like where it's got like the big center. Definitely would like to see an SVR version or a five liter supercharger where it has different kit, different style bumpers, different wheels, so it looks a lot more sporty. So, last time at the boxing, it was Derek Chisora versus my son. Derek beat him the last time. It's the rematch. We're at the petrol station. It's the rematch. All right, you ready? No pressure. Boy, uh, uh, the face to face is on. This guy, boy. Man, don't hurt him. He's fighting next week here, so don't hurt him, yeah? It's on. Yeah. Let's go. Let's do this. 1 0, Derek. 1 oh 1. 2 1, Andrew. Two. Oh. <laughs> Did he lose again? It was 3 2. Three two. Was it 3 2? <laughs> That's what we want to see next Saturday, yeah? The champ. <laughs> Yes. Yeah. No, why? Why do you do that? Say hello. Hi. Say, Papa. say, say Papa. Papa. Hi, it's Jay from the Crep Cleaner. I've got Yanni's shoes. Let's go check it out. So the boys at Crep Cleaner smashed it. My trainers are brand new, and to be fair to them, they did exactly what they said they were gonna do. Here are some before and afters. Look how bad they were. I pretty much battered my trainers, but they're fresh again, and there's a lesson here. Keep your trainers clean, or just have Jay on speed dial. So we're back at the house and the guys are finishing off the pool cover. So they've added the ends now. Where well, it was all done and they've added like two little ends. The reason they've done that is because when the pool slides all the way across, the gap between here and there isn't enough for the whole pool to go across. So what you're gonna see is, as my lovely assistant is showing us right now, from Shebang. So as you can see, look, it keeps going all the way, all the way, all the way. Okay, it stops there, which means the pool has still got bits on it. However, however, and here comes the genius master plan. Pull that over, obviously it'll have a lever and stuff like that. And theoretically, you could leave it like that or you could do the other end as well. And then it can go all the way across. Look at that, look at that. Wow, it's so shiny. My God, I can't even see. And there it is, guys. Genius. You've got no idea how difficult this was to make when I spoke to loads of companies. But man like Scott from Shebang said, I've got this. And to be fair, he did. There was a couple of times I was a bit nervous and I didn't think he'd pull it off, but he's managed to, to sort this out. Did, did you have faith in Scott the whole time? I did. I did. You liar. <laughs> <laughs> and we'll get Pav to come in and put the decking over to make it look nice and finish it off. These will all go today, and obviously the decking's over there. And you're probably thinking, well, why has a security firm done this? The why they've done this is because it's a gate laying down. So it's like them doing a gate, and they've just done a gate laying down. But they're known for this sort of stuff. The cameras, the lasers, the sensors, and things like that, but I ain't gonna lie, I'm pleased with this. I shouldn't be here right now. Ah, oh, that's snake you. What's this for? Yanni Monthly. I should be at Yanni's. <laughs> 
<laughs> oh, what time is it? Like 8.20. I, I'm still here in all fairness because Parrot kept calling for more tools. Oh, so you come back to get tools? No, nah, literally, I'm going to go. And every second he kept calling and saying, yo, I need tools, I need this, I need that. And literally, I thought, cool, see, Parrot was taking long. I might as well make myself coffee, innit? And then go. Where you getting? Big man's job. Big man's job. Yeah. Hey, how do you turn the selfie mode or whatever? Yeah, uh... Alright, cool, so I'm on my way to Big Man's house. Oh, else is running away. Yo, get a teammate, Yanni Malfi, crossover. Damn, man. Oh, yeah. Let's go. Javi's here. I've just sent Rio to go and get the deck in. So we're going to put all the deck in over the top. Pab's got his, all his tools working outside today. This is what Pab prefers. This You prefer this, don't you? I love this. This is a bit of you, isn't it? Stripping and fitting cars is cool, and it's your bread and butter, but that's, that's sound systems and, well and doing other bits is what you like to do. But yeah, we're finally getting there. Finally getting there. Uzi, we're finally getting there. So obviously, I'm gonna cover all the ends. Just have a tiny, tiny little gap so it can slide back and forth, but it avoids the pool getting dirty. And that'll be all the way around, even this side. And then Scott from Shaban going to bring me hooks to be able to lift this over. So Rio's here, he's come back with the new decking and some screws. So, and we're fitting these in between. So you obviously need to have a slight gap because the boards can expand. Tell us all the time. Oh, you're more recording? Yeah. Right, so we are laying the deckings. Bit of a mission this one is because obviously these screws we're supposed to go into wood and we're going into steel. So you can tell these guns pumping, I'm joking. I'm drilling pilot holes, impacting dry, pilot holes, impact dry, pilot holes, impact, pilot holes, impact. But we're getting there, sun's out as well, which is good. So, um, enjoy. Let's crack on. My arms are killing from lifting all 40 of these. All from the van, I had to go to the merchants, the building merchants, to go collect it all. So, yeah, let's crack on. So, end of the day, Pav, over there. What are we saying, cuz? We say it looks gangster. Finished. Wow. We had a nightmare with the screws, but we managed to do it because that's how we roll. And uh, I think it looks good. Yan's gonna like it. So happy days. So, yeah, all complete for now, and then we're leaving the rest of Shebang to finish. Shebang, Shebang. Saturday night, heading to the O2 with man like Babs, Derek Chisora's fighting Pulev, you know when Derek fights it's always a war, so um, hopefully it'll be a good fight and hopefully Derek gets the win. Right, we're heading to the fight and um, yeah, it should be a good one. Look, 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 look at my man, look, come, and get, come <laughs> to get a picture, come to get a picture of the traffic lights. Massive fan. Cool my brother, love, love you. Thank you, see you. See you later. All the way, 12 rounds. We're now waiting for the decision. Let's see what happens. Who won? Who won? Derek or Pulev? I, I say Derek. I reckon it's Derek. I reckon yeah? it's Derek. I'll go with Derek. Chizora, 100%. Yeah? All day, yeah? Derek. Derek. Everyone's saying Derek. Let's hope it's Derek. We're about to get the result. The time I had a win was uh, David Price. That was the beginning of Corona. It feels great, man. Uh, you know what? I needed that. I needed that. Cause I, I tell you why I needed that. Cause the other day I whispered in Eddie's head, Eddie head that if I win this, can you get me the answer? He said yes, deliver. I said yes. So heading out with the wife. Nathan kindly let me borrow his V8 
me car because usually I drive everywhere. So we're in his luxury B-class. It's very nice to be fair. Take me to your heart, take me to your soul, never drawn apart, cause I belong, I belong to you, be my guiding star, cause I need your love and baby, and never let me down, let me down. So today, we're at the house. So Dino's here to give it a first wash, the car, giving it a first wash first. When the sun's beaming down, you need to have them both here. You gotta be on this quick when it's wet, yeah? When it's, oh, yeah, when it's yeah, hot. Yeah. You have to move quick, that's why I've got me and, my, uh, me and Dave today. Monaco Dave, yeah? Monaco Dave, you guys. <laughs> yeah, one rinse in, one moving all the time, so yeah. You've got the canopy, but obviously at the moment it's in the shade and the sun's gonna come out, so yeah. Keep it moving. You gotta keep it moving. <laughs> is filthy and the reason the pool's filthy is because people have been working on top of the pool this that's how it is filthy the weather's about 30 31 degrees same weather as cyprus we're getting there we're finally getting there the summer's here and it's great i thought it's got a really really white skin like her mum even though steph's full greek i've got the real data skin steph's got the real white skin even though we're both greek so she's taken after her mum who's he yeah Who's he? Sit. Sit. Down. So that's Miles, that's the pool guy. He just turned up. So famous. 13.4 13 on TikTok. But how many you got on Insta? Uh, only about 300,000. Only about... He's the pool guy. You know what I mean? I'm not, YouTube's I'm the... all right. 800,000 on YouTube. That's good. 800,000 on YouTube, 300,000 on Instagram, and 13 million on... Here I come. Unbelievable, and it's all because of that. The way the way the pool is, everyone just—it's—it's it's, it's like therapeutic, isn't it? Mate, I've been to see a pools. filthy pool and then having it all clean and stuff I've been like doing that. Been doing pools for 14 years. Yeah. If I knew, if I knew people love watching it that much, I'd have started it a long time ago. I only started it two years ago. Yeah, Dino were in. Dino wanted to meet us. Did you see Dino? I've been speaking to him for a while. Speaking, yeah, but he I'm always not... says, "There you go. There's the pool guy." So famous, you lot are. Okay, so there's the pool guy. It's Miles. Nice to meet you, finally, man. Yeah, good to you. Yeah. Ooh, friends! Yeah. Exactly. Ooh, cleaning friends! <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, distinctive detail pool guy friends! Right, let's have a look. Let's go and have a look at the pool. Right, let's have a look at the pool. I've seen a bit. Quite cool, isn't it? That's it, man. Does the job, isn't it? Have a look at the pool, how dirty the pool is. So, Shebang are coming back today, we just need to add a couple of handles and um, then that'll be finished. But it covers the pool, it'll keep it warm. And obviously you've got to have the pool guy here because this pool is filthy. With my head underwater. So we're just setting up the uh, vacuum equipment now. That's my vac to waste Easy. pump. And that's gonna go yeah, out there down the drain. Done, check the chemicals, clean the filter, and uh, yeah, that'll be job done. When they done the pool cover and stuff like that, obviously they're chopping, the pool was open, I didn't even care. And obviously bits have gone into the pool and it's sort of stuck onto, onto the aluminium. It just needs to be brushed off and cleaned. Just get a simple test on the chlorine and the pH. So your pH is really low, it's going to be quite acidic and it's, going to, it's not going to be really very good for like the components in the pump and start, start stripping it. If you've got no chlorine, obviously, that's when you're going to start going green. But I can see he's already got some in here, so and I can already see that the pH is a little bit high. I need to add some pH minus in to bring that level down.
plug your YouTube. Tell me your YouTube channel. Paul Guy ML on YouTube. There's a picture Easy. on the screen right now. Click this. Right here. Usually I get to be in the picture now. I must take the picture. Brother, thank you. Have a good holiday. Hello. Monaco Dave, be good. Thanks for watching guys. I hope you enjoyed this Yanni Monthly and we'll be back next month. But before you go, don't forget to download Pouch. The link is in the description. See you later.